Okay, now we're going to do the shoulder point to shoulder point, which is your shoulder measurement. So what we need to do is get from like edge to edge. So I'm just going across the nape of your neck and folding all the way down. So now we need the sleeve length. Now this is completely preference to you again. So we're going to go from the tip of the shoulder where we've just measured and go all the way down. Okay, now we're going to take the chest measurement. So what we need to do is put your arms up like this. Wrap the um, tape measure all the way around, across the edge of the boob, like this. Pop your arms down, and then take that measurement. So now we need bust point to bust point, which is the edges here. So pop your tape measure across, from the tip to the tip. So now we're going to do the bust back. This is quite simple. We're going to go from armpit to armpit across the back, as like so. And now we need the bicep measurement. So you just need to wrap that around, pop your arm down as you would normally, and then take the measurement. And now we need your neck measurement. So what we'll do, Put the tape measure all the way around and then take that measurement. So now we need to fit in the width of the waist, which is the smallest point here. So again, pop your arms up, wrap the tape measure around, and then take that measurement when you pop your arms down. So now we're going to do the stomach measurement. So if you pop your arms up again, and it's slightly lower than the waist measurement we took before. So now we're going to do the seat measurement. So what you do is just fold your arms like this, and then wrap the tape measure around, taking that measurement. So now we need the measurement between your waist and your seat here. Now this isn't your trouser waist, this is just the measurement between. So I'll fold my arms again, take that measurement, Now we're going to do the actual trouser waist. Now this measurement will be where exactly you like your trousers to sit. So I like mine slightly a little higher, so we're going to go from this, but obviously whatever's your preference. So now we're going to do the back long. Now this is preferential to you again. What we're going to do today is go from the nape of the neck where you should start and then length will go wherever you like. Now I usually like to have mine covering my seat. And now we need the front line. So that will go from your shoulder point here and go all the way down to where you'd like it to be. Okay, now we need to take the top front. So what you need to do, Pop the tape measure from the shoulder and bring it down to the tip of the bust. 